Hey guys, it's Dale. I am here with another flavor review, and today I have the lovely Zach and Dave with me today. Um, I'm sure you've seen them from our past videos, so yeah. And we will be talking about Quest Vapor. Um, Quest Vapor is a Max VG line. It is 85 VG, 15 PG. They have three flavors, and they are 50 ml bottles for $16.99. 50 ml bottles for $16.99. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna try them and let you know what we think. What are we baking on today? Um, this first one will be Milan. This is the first time I've ever baked for one I've only ever used a tank. So oh, like you, never used a, you never used a dripper? No, <laughs> I'm, I'm still a newbie by <laughs> very... This will be, this will by be fun. By most standards. Oh. This will be fun. Uh, trek across the globe to Milan to vape the sweet flavors of an orange Italian cremosa. Huh. Okay, so an orange Italian cremosa. What's a cremosa? That it's was like, my question. It's like a, um, it's like a cream like soda. Cream. It's like a cream. Okay. Yeah, it's like a cream soda. So, the cream definitely comes through with this one. I only taste the orange like on the exhale. Mm. But the cream does come through. You get a cream right up front. Yeah. Orange citrus on the exhale. It's very light with it being a Max VG, right? Yes. How are you doing with the dripper? Fine. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, yeah. it's good. So my concern about all Max VG lines is that you lose flavor. I, I think that these are might be meant to kind of have just a chill flavor. It's very chill. Um, mm -hmm. Just because they come in 50 ml bottles, so they want it to be like all day vape. Does that it's make a good. Sense? It's a good flavor, but if you're looking for like a strong, like some of our vape wild juices, if you're looking for a very strong flavor, you're not going to get that. But if you want a nice subtle flavor that's not going to wear out your taste buds, I think it's great. For that. Good cloud production. I if, agree. if you have, if you're, if you're a Max VG person. Pretty good. Yeah. I, I was worried about the orange, but I like that the cream kind of mixes well with it. The orange isn't super overpowering either, which is good. I like orange a lot, but too much orange can kind of blow your taste buds out. Yes. Um, all right, next one is NYC. And disclosing information, Dave has tried this one and it's his favorite. It is my favorite. <laughs> It is. You want to read it this time? Yeah. Journey okay. to New York City, where the flavors come to life in this candy Big Apple vape. I'm also a fan of New York City, the actual destination. Yes, yeah, if you couldn't tell by the hat. Oh. <laughs> I never put that together. <laughs> so I'll talk about this one a little bit before we actually taste it. I know this one. I like this one. It's a caramel apple with a little slight... You think it's a caramel apple? I do. I, do. I think there's a caramel... It's a candied apple, which to me says caramel. No, they have candy. I, I understand, but I think it, I get a little bit of... Very slight. Okay. I get a red apple with a slight caramel candy and a slight crust. But it's, again, it's not overpowering. It's really, really good in a tank, so I'm interested to see what it tastes like on a dripper. Um, yeah. Um, I, it smells like straight up sweet apples. It smells like caramel apple. See, I I smell the caramel. I don't smell that. Alright. <laughs> Fine. Fine. That sounds good. Is this one three? Yeah, okay. So this one's a three milligram. The throat hit is there, um, and it's sweet. Oh, I'm so sorry. No, it's fine. I don't mind. I just I'm not, and I'm more of a zero nick professional than I. <laughs> zero nick. But the flavor I really like. Like I, that, it's a, it's the apple is definitely there. But it's like with the other one, it's it's got a stronger flavor, I think, than Milan. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But the apple is it's there, but it's not, again, overpowering. It's not super, super sweet. It's more of a nice sort of subtle apple. I'm surprised that the flavor is is not muted. 
um, mm -hmm. because the flavor is there. Yeah. The flavor is there. Mm -hmm. I do not taste caramel though, or caramel or. Whatever. I get straight caramel apple out of a dripper. I don't get the crust that I get out of a tank. Okay. Which is interesting. My taste buds not be refined. I get the apple. I'm not picking anything else up. But for me, it's not a bad thing. I mean, I, I like the flavor of apple. I haven't found an apple flavor I like. That's a pretty good apple That's flavor for me. And I like. I yeah. tend my personally, I tend to like things that aren't quite as overpoweringly sweet. So these are like right in my wheelhouse because they're. I'm getting the flavor, but I'm not feel like I'm eating pieces of candy all the time. Yeah, this one is not not. Diabetes. Not diabetes. <laughs> yeah, I, I deal with enough of that. Yeah. I don't um, but yeah, it is not it is not too sweet at all. What tank do you use that these work well in? I use the the baby and the big baby quite a bit, and uh, those seem to work very well with it. Okay. I do have some priming issues with the Max VG, so I just let it sit for a while all right. before I start vaping on. That was my next question. Yeah. Cool. All right, this one's Moscow. And it says, open your palate to this delicious peach and black currant e-liquid. Okay. Okay, so I've never had actual black currant, but I have had black currant vapes. You haven't had a black currant candy? I have not. I never okay. either. So they make these things called uh, wine candies, and they mm. do not have, I'm shaking, they do not have alcohol in them. They are just to eat. Huh. Um, but they have a black currant one, and it is... One of my favorite candies of all time. Really? And I love black currant vapes. Okay. I'm interested in how this tastes because remember with our mystery flavor from June, yeah. a lot of people got peach, the peach off yeah. of black currant. So I'm curious currant. to see how they work together. Is this one a three also? Yeah, it is. Watch your lungs. Oh, all right. You want to go ahead and go for the Yeah. Time? So. That one's my favorite. It smells like peach. <laughs> yes, it does. That's really good. I like peaches. If you don't like peaches or have an aversion to peaches, you're not gonna like this one. But if you like peaches, that's it really like good. Peach. It smells like peach. It tastes like peach. Well, it's, it smells like a one of those peach rings, those candy peach rings. Yeah. Okay, I completely understand why people thought they were getting. Peach rings all the <clears throat> current. That, if that's what it tastes like, it's like unsugared peach rings. It's really good. I like it. I think that this one is um, the sweetest of the three. Really? But even then, it's not that sweet. Like, right. It's a, it's a it's definitely like of the flavor strengths, like light flavor, better flavor. This has the strongest flavor, but still, it's not an overpowering flavor. But it's definitely. The strongest, but it's not. It's, it's not sweet. It tastes like eating a peach, and not eating like it's not like a candy peach. It's okay. very much a real peach. I've never had black currant. Does black currant taste like peach? No. Does that taste like black currant? I think that black currant is in there to round it okay. out. I also think if I were to kick the water up a little bit, we would taste more of the black currant. Well, it's delicious peach and black currant is the name. I of mean, there's definitely an aftertaste to it, which is different from peach. It's okay. like a flavor that I'm not used to because I've never had currant, so I don't know it. So maybe that. It's comes kind of it. like um, uh, black currants taste like muddled cherries, kind of. Mm. Um, yeah, it has its own flavor, but it's kind of like a cherry, um, but not like a cherry. I like peaches. I don't like peach flavored anything. This is pretty good. I like that. I mean, I, 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 I honestly is probably going to walk out of the room and go get a bottle of these two because I really like these and I want to try and vape on them for a while. Well, I, my favorite out of all of them is the Moscow. If you had to rank them, you'd go Moscow first. Uh huh. Down this way. Down yeah, yeah. Moscow. I would too. I see them along. I would too, only because I like peach a little more than apple. Mm. But. And I, I'm almost a little, I want to say I'm a little disappointed in Milan, only in the sense that I wish it had a little more orange flavor, because these have the good flavor. If the orange was a little stronger than that one, I'd be all over Milan, because I'm an orange fan. But of these, definitely Moscow the best. I like them all, Interesting. Though. I'm different. I would go, I would go NYC. It's because you're a homer. Yeah, I'm a homer NYC. for New York. <laughs> um, I would go NYC first, because I love the candied apple. Mm -hmm. And then I would go Milan, because I loved orange cream sickles when I was a kid and it tastes a lot like that mm. it's not I agree with what you said the orange is not quite as strong I need to I think I, need, I think if I vaped on it some more I probably would Milan could move up but I yeah. I mean just for me I'm a fan of all three I think they're what I'm used to vaping tends to be a little bit stronger flavor and a little sweeter more powerful 
These are much more subtle, and I think my taste buds personally like a little more subtle flavor, and those fit for me really well. Yeah. And I, I, I like the presentation. Yep. The um, bottle's cool. The bottle's cool. It's a well, three-sided bottle. The We're, stickers are awesome. Stickers are good. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's Labels, a really cool looking stickers. Labels, yeah. The, it's a three-sided bottle, and it's got a label on each side, including uh, the flavor description here with the name and uh, all your warnings and stuff, and then the main label here. And uh, they come in these awesome boxes. This is what it will look like uh, when it gets to you, like this. Um, and on the back, uh, it says their story. Um, their tagline is, where will your quest take you? And um, yeah, so it's very, very nice. They are 50 mil bottles, 50, five zero. I'm not going to carry this around in my pocket, though. No. Wham! There yeah. it is. Um, they do come with a 15 mil little unicorn bottle. Um, I'm sure we'll put a close up on the bottle here somewhere um, in the video, but they have Quest actually written on the bottle, which mm -hmm. I think is awesome. Um, yeah, anytime you get a massive bottle, you always want a little second bottle. Little smaller bottle. I don't know. Sure. What to say. And look, too, if you're trying to get like your friends into vaping, or you have family or friends who are smoking, you want to try vape. Just having one of these bottles sitting around, I think, would get their attention. They'd be like, "What is that?" <laughs> so your mom like dips it. And... <laughs> but it's, it's, it's the cool thing about it is like obviously with vape, you want the liquid that you buy to be good and you want to enjoy it. But that's almost like a talk piece too. Yeah, you could, nice bottle. Um, I am also blown away by the price. Sixteen ninety nine for a fifty mil bottle with a unicorn bottle with the box. I mean that's. Um... This will stand out on shelves. I mean, yeah. if I saw that in a, in a if I saw that in a shop, I would have, I would definitely ask questions. Oh yeah. Yeah. I want to see it. Um, these being Max VG, um, and I'm a dripper, so I love my Max VGs, and the two that I love having a really good flavor for Max VG line, and this packaging and everything that comes with it for sixteen ninety nine. That's kind Can't of beat a, that price. Yeah. Kind of steel. <laughs> it's a steel for sure. Um, like yeah. It. So, so yeah. thank you for doing this little round table get together flavor review. I don't know what we're calling it anymore. Um, <laughs> yeah, so this is Quest Vapor, and that's what we thought about it. And you can get yours at vapewild.com.